What these freeholders are doing is unconscionable. We need to let them know that either they reverse their decision or there are going to be consequences. They've never reversed a decision. They have never met me before. Their next meeting, we show up with 100 protesters, gay cops, gay attorneys, a priest, a rabbi. I know a couple gay grandmothers. Maybe we organize a gay pride parade. You mean a bunch of bare-chested men in leather marching down Main Street? We show them that we are a force to be reckoned with. In this county, there are a quarter million senior citizens, registered Republicans. You're going to turn them all against Laurel. I appreciate your perspective. I ran Corzine's Senate campaign in 2000, so I know what I'm doing. Okay, Steve, but I know this community. It's Stephen with a V, as in very gay. And when people disrespect my gay brothers and sisters, I rain terror on them. Shock and awe. Shock and awe. And sweetheart, I am going to need you to be available for interviews. Lots and lots of interviews. This is going to be a national news story. Stephen, it seems to me that you're using my case to promote your cause, gay marriage. That is exactly what I'm doing. This is the case that I've been waiting for, that I've been dreaming of. This is going to put this issue in the national spotlight. It's going to turn the tide for gay marriage. My fight is not about marriage. It's about equality. It's about a cop getting the benefits. Not about it. marriage. Are you kidding me? I'm sorry. I just, I'm very passionate about this. If you were married, and not this bullshit second-class citizen domestic partner crap, but married, there wouldn't be an issue. Stacy would be entitled to your benefits. Hell, if you and I got married tomorrow, I'd be entitled to your benefits. Is that a proposal? Oh, honey, I will marry you. But I wouldn't know what to do with your vagina. Oh my God. I just don't want this whole political thing to take over our lives. And we need to get you better. All this hoopla isn't necessary. All we need are Ocean County voters at the next freeholder meeting. Radicals and strangers from New York aren't going to convince these guys. I am not a radical, and I am not from New York. I am a middle-class Jewish homosexual from New Jersey. How about you, sweetheart? I'm a straight, white, Anglo-Saxon, ex-Protestant, atheist cop. You okay with that, sweetheart? I am. That is very hot. It's an opportunity to change the world. Laurel, this can be your legacy.